All right, back to unmetal. Now, if I'm hiding in the shadows like I am now, they won't see me even though they like totally could, right? Okay, good. Okay. Had nothing on him. Spared myself a coin this time. Hmm. Maybe just gotta walk right up on him and just punch him to the punch him in the face. But I mean, obviously, with that guy not looking at me, shit. Face escape. Fuck. Okay. Oh, both of my potties are empty, so I can potty as soon as I knock that guard out. Oh no, they're not. Both of them are full now. Okay, so I should probably go empty them. <sighs> it's worth it. And also, did I? I thought I had more than two potties by this point last time. Like, I thought I had like three potties by this time. But, you know, maybe I'm wrong. My girl wants to party all the time, party all the time, party all the time. Why? Why can't I potty? I can't potty near this guy. <laughs> okay. Hmm. That doesn't make sense. No, I pottied, I, I remember pottying with. Now, hold on a second. When it said you can't do it with a guard outside, like a sleep outside, like at all. I thought it was just like in the same screen you couldn't do it. But it must mean at all, like anywhere on the map. Okay, must mean anywhere on the, on the map at all. Okay. That's fine. I just didn't. I'm. I, the wording was a little ambiguous to me. 
Oh, shut up! Will this playthrough be on YouTube? Yes, it will eventually. But if you want to watch it uh, more quickly than that, if you're impatient, it will be uh, not in my past broadcasts. It will be in my highlights, chopped up with the brakes taken out. God damn it. Turn around, you asshole. Turn around. Was that? Case, escaping prison. Send back. He heard me punching. He heard me punching his guy's his friend's face. Turn around every now and then. I'm a little miss and I found a hood and bam. Turn around. So you can talk about sluts and hoes next episode. What? The experience points just too good to pass up. Oh, I didn't change it. Okay. Guys were like, hey, what the fuck? Oh, weird. So they just like separated from the pack. What was that? Shit. Yeah, I was thinking maybe you could pick him off if you do that. That's pretty neat. Oh, someone's got an idea. The alarm was raised. The platoons must have found one of the guards I knocked out. I had to cover my tracks better. Okay. That's the safeguard so you can't like, you can't take one of them. He's the only one still on, on foot patrol there. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> that was pretty funny.
Hmm. I'd probably be able to flip a coin. Whoops! Flip a coin through the through the other uh, through to the other screen, maybe. that truck you piece of garbage around so fast it's a spoof what up crafty dog oh yeah it's a spoof of the original of the uh, Metal Gear series it's a spoof it's a satire it's a farce it's a a love letter it's like naked gun or hot shots it's like you know There we go. All right. Now we don't have to break the, the door or the toilet anymore. Or the sink, I mean. Can we make it before they get back? Yeah, we got plenty of time. Plenty of time. Beautiful. Oh, I'm fucked. Nope, I'm not. I'm fine. Totally fine. And, and homage. Die, truck. I'm going to do that to every truck. Oh, there's a space there. As I walked in, I ran into a soldier. Fuck, did the I? The guy was so hammered oh. that he confused me with one of his buddies. Oh, good. Hey. Mike! Mike. You want a drink? <laughs> uh, no thank you. I don't drink when I escape. Hold on. You're not Mike. No, I'm Fox. Jesse Fox. You're the prisoner? I would escape too, if I could. The fuck am I Why? saying this? To see my daughter. Oh, good it lord. It turns out that he had a little daughter. Kill him! Who he hadn't seen in three years. Oh, God. Every year he requests leave to go oh, see her. God. And every year his drill sergeant rejects uh, it. Poor man. So, in a week, the daughter was turning six. And Mike requested leave again. And yet, <laughs> again. The drill sergeant rejected it, which was why he was drowning his sorrows. Until he knocked himself out. Help Mike having his permission ready. Help Mike having his permission ready. That sounds like a, an English translation mishap. I couldn't stamp the form until I found an ink pad. Uh. Or a tampon. <laughs> hmm. Alright. 
Sorry, I had to take a leak real quick. That's a Franklish line that never got to me. It's on the next patch. Wow, that was close. Oh. My fucking bathroom right here. I ran into a guard as I went in. Every time? Another one? He was urinating. Okay. Please don't tell me you pissed that guard off while he was urinating. I couldn't. Someone beat me to it. What the hell are you doing, scumbag? Sir, I'm peeing, sir. <laughs> Did you wash your hands? Uh, no, sir. I'll wash them when I'm done, sir. Are you touching your dick with your dirty hands? How can you be such a pig? Hands are washed before, not after peeing. Sir, yes, sir. Why did you stop peeing, scumbag? Sir, I ran out of pee, sir. What a pussy! Who do you think you are, a fucking sibyl? A soldier continues peeing even if his balls are empty. Now get the hell out of here! Jesus sir, Christ. Yes, sir. Sergeant, there's someone behind you. Fuck, soldier, did I tell you to look behind me? Uh, no, sir. Then why the hell are you looking behind me? Here, you don't look, listen, or speak unless I tell you to do it. Understood? Sir, yes, sir. That damn drill sergeant acted tough with his men. I'm gonna take he a ended stamp! Up crying like a baby with me. Uh. Who the fuck are you? And where the hell is your uniform? Okay, here we go. All right. So we gotta have a little, uh, little jab fest. I'm gonna say. It was stolen. It's been stolen, sir. Someone broke into my locker and took it. And who the hell was it? It was, um, uh, Clue. We still don't know his identity, sir, but we have a clue. What clue, you fuck? We know he was born. Uh, place. In the same state you were, sir. So that son of a bitch is from Texas. Hold on. You're telling me you're from Texas? Only two things come out of Texas. Propane and assholes. I don't see any propane accessories. And I know you're full of shit. Me full of shit? What, you little? Of course you are. Look at your brown eyes. What? My eyes are blue. You sure? The whole base is talking about your brown eye. No. No. I'm not. Just as he started to tear up, I helped old Blue Eyes kiss the canvas. Oh, did I just nail it? Boss defeated. Oh, wow. Okay. Thanks, dude. Oh, I mean... Freeze, or I'll shoot. Boom. What the hell are you doing, scumbag? Aiming at you with my weapon. Fuck, soldier, did I tell you to aim your weapon at me? Uh, no, sir. Then why the hell are you aiming your fucking weapon at me? Here you don't look, listen, or speak unless I tell you to do it. Understood? Sir, yes, sir. Did you wash your hands before <laughs> aiming your weapon at me, scumbag? Uh, no, sir. Fuck, how can you be such a pig? Get the hell out of here. Sir, yes, sir. Well, the only one that I actually figured logically was the last one because of the place. Because I figured, like, the min and soda thing, like, he was from a place, so I figured that might be the thing. But, got lucky. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, shit. Oh, he's gone. Oh, well. Oh, well. Yep, I think I'm fucked here. Yep. Oh, well, I, I, I missed all the failures because I'm just, I'm just so good at things. I'm sorry. I do want to see him, but I guess we'll have to, like, I don't know how to go. I don't know what. I 
suppose I could go into the files, like the actual game files and find a save, but. <laughs> yeah, or replay the game. Yeah, sure. Oh, don't, no, Jack, don't worry about it. It's okay. People, you, hey, buy the game. Buy the fucking game if you want to see the fail conditions on that one. That one, I just nailed it. Like, because I basically wake up and I piss excellence into a portable uh, urinal toilet potty. So. Or you could watch Co. I'm sure there's a clip of Co failing over and over. The there you go. I saw that it was different from the others. First off, it had its own urinal. Boom! Moreover, it had an office desk. With a stamp I right on it. it I see it right there. Sergeant's quarters. I had plenty of time because I was sure he was still indisposed in the bathroom. The desk had stacks of papers and an ink pad chained onto it. Um. Oh, stacks of paper with an ink pad there. Oh, I gotta do it here. Okay. Got it. So I give it to the crying guy, I'm, I'm guessing, but I, he left, right? Or did he? Maybe he didn't. Oh no, he passed out. That's right, he passed out. I returned the stamped permission form to the same pocket I found it in. That soldier was going to have a fucking great surprise when he woke up. Help Mike having his permission ready. Done. And what's this? Oh, 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 oh another one. There's my third potty. Huzzah. And there he was. Oh. The bastard with a machine gun, blocking my way to the north gate. But I didn't fight him until I got some grenades. Right. Are you sure I didn't? And there he was. Oh. The bastard Damn with it, a machine gun. Damn it, I was hoping there was going to be a different, my way a different voice line. Gate. But I didn't fight him until I got some J -Man, grenades. J-Man, fighter of the D-Man, champion of the balls. Thank you for the 11 months, J-Man. He's got night blindness, I think. That dude got night blindness is probably what the case is. I couldn't, I couldn't do the, the chloroform either. Like, he didn't see me, but I couldn't chloroform him. So it was like a war of, like, uh, attrition. You know, the, uh, the unstoppable force immovable object. <laughs> Oops. Let's see if we can make that happen again. I heard something. <laughs> That'll do, pig. That'll do.
I'm saving over that shit. That was amazing. That shit was amazing. I just stood there and I was like, I'm invisible. I'm invisible. I'm invisible. Ha! <laughs> uh, Base Ventura 39. Woo! Fuck these dudes' asses! <laughs> I'm trying. I'm trying to fuck these dudes' asses. Oh, the name of the voice actor for... Yeah, it's uh, um, Andrew Miller, also known as... V oh, Velis. Velis? Novus. 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 That's what it is. Novus. Gonna sneak right by that guy. him dude I'm like pro style speed running this game now do I, how many do I have for the chloroform am I done with it I might be done with it I might not need to do it anymore Oh, nope. Oh, I, I 15 of 20. Okay, there it is. Five more. Shit, shit. I'm <laughs> not, not sure about the speed, but you're, you're running it. You're, you, 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 you do, you, you're doing good. You're Fox, right? I knew you were going to pass through here sooner or later. I'm Machine Gun Mike. Are you ready to face me? Or are you going to run away like a coward? Run away? I don't run from dead men. Oh! Then prepare to die. Oh. Oh my god, Machine Mike. Not Machine Gun Mike, mind you. It's Machine Mike. Please. Please. Machine Gun Mike is my father. Short one. That was short. Uh, let's see. Yeah. Your fault. Just gotta wait a little itty bit longer. Ah, okay. Your fault. Hide as much as you want. Those sandbags are very ah! oh, Okay, so I can roll under them. All right, all right, all right. You're Hide as much as you want. Those sandbags won't last. Oh, fart balls! He started shooting. I was wondering how many I could get two off. 
Two and then I gotta refresh. Okay. You're Hide as much as you want. Those sandbags will go to the For my trap. I waited a little before shooting all my bullets. So you think I was reloading? Damn you! That was pretty good though. You destroyed my machine gun! Damn you, Fox! Boss defeated! Hey! Boss defeated! <laughs> that was pretty great. I gotta admit, that was pretty cool. Alright. I I trick you. I think you think I'm reloading. I am not. <laughs> I arrived at the northern parking lot. There were trucks and containers all over the place. I wanted to hide in the right truck. Serial number 233980. But Machine Gun Mike could be waiting for me, seeking revenge. All right, reach northern entrance. Oh, uh, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, dude! On, Fox. Try tossing your puny oh, now. oh, I, I get a gun, Mike. I get a rocket launcher. Nope. Now I go by the name Splash Mike. Why splash? Because I'm going to splash your entrails all over the place. <laughs> Oh my god. It's Splash Mike now! <laughs> that gun is fast and deadly. I punch guards into Zeke's mouth. I punch guards into Zeke's mouth. I punch guards into Zeke's mouth. I guess I'm just gonna be punching guards into Zeke's mouth all day. That's right. Oh, do those guys? Oh, do they stop like? Oh, stop running around. I was, I was gonna wait and blast them with a grenade. I what the? Oh, man. <laughs> That's real good, though, right? All right, we'll get a full heal on. I don't know if it matters, but we'll get a full heal. Save it. Be ready. Oh, can I empty my hand? So I can't have nothing. Because I would love it if I could have nothing in my hand and then just pick up the rocket launcher without having to, you know, switch, go to my menu and switch to it. I arrived. on the roll too early on the roll I rocket launcher perfect for destroying vehicles I don't have any rockets
There it is. Okay. I had an eyebrow hair that was kept curling into my eye. Wow, okay. Dirty tank. Rockets barely scratched the paint job. But why didn't you attack it from behind? It's the weak point of many models. I was testing its entire surface on Yeah! It. I concluded that every side was strong, except the rear. Duh. Motherfuck! Okay, so I do need, I need the rocket. Should have been firing those the entire time, damn it. I arrived. <sighs> Challenge unlocked. Find or destroy, uh, destroy five trucks in the barracks north parking lot before Splash Mike does with his tank. Oh, okay. Two at a time. Okay. Wow, that was close. I do it on that. I get him. One more. Oh. Ah, son of a bitch.
Oh, did I miss one? I missed one, huh? Okay. Yeah, I sent a truck right at the beginning. Okay. That makes sense. What? No, get... I get to keep the achievement though, right? I do. Okay. So I'm gonna do that again. I splash damage. What's that one? Let Splash Mike destroy all crates and trucks at the barracks. Okay. You can still shoot him. Yeah, sure. I know. I know. But you see, that's what happens when I get distracted. Crates and trucks are not barrels, by the way. Did not say barrels. I said crates and trucks though. What the fuck? Yeah, you could probably better write that one down.
No, wait. Jesus. I this is not going to be easy. Oh god, is this going to is this going to fucking fuck me on the angle? Nope, it's not. Okay, we're good. That one's gonna be a fucking pain. No, it wasn't bullshit, it was fine. The angle was fine. Just didn't, didn't swing my way. Ugh, fucking hell. Almost did it a fucking gan, man. Jesus Christ. The medal, right? I picked up the achievement thing. The challenge. Okay, I did. 17 of 21. All right. We're close. I got it, so I don't have to do it again. <clears throat> right? Yeah. Okay. I you don't have to... The good thing is you don't have to kill him afterwards. So now I can just focus on, you know, destroying the asshole. That's what she said. Uh, uh, uh. 
right. You fucking dickhead. <laughs> I'm trying to put my hot hot rockets up his rear. Fucking miss that first one. You gotta be kidding me! Is there no friendly fire? Cause boy, I almost blew the fuck out of myself. I mean, it's defeated. <laughs> it's slow, it's deliberate, but it's not easy, man. You, it's, it's not easy. Just saying it's not easy. Medical expert, you can hold four more maximum healing kits or gag reflex. You sedate guards twice as fast and drag them faster. Woo, yeah. After dealing with the tank, I found the truck and hid inside. The driver showed up a few minutes later and unknowingly ate at my escape. And the military didn't find it weird that everything in the northern parking lot was destroyed? Goodbye, Jack. Who knows? Maybe it's a regular occurrence. But the truck driver must have seen all that destruction. Well, you know how military grunts are. They only think when ordered to. True. Stage complete! I hate that. I hate it so much. I got all the XP, but I missed two fucking secrets. That bothers me. Chapter 6, Engineering Problems. So, in the end, you escaped hidden on that truck? Yep. 
What about the shit you told me about not escaping in a truck to prevent pollution? Because the first time, it would have been me behind the wheel. This time, the truck was going to leave, with or without me. Which means the pollution wasn't my fault. How convenient. Fox, do you copy? I'm a little busy! Hey, it's the Concrete Paparazzi. <laughs> <laughs> concrete Paparazzi. <laughs> Such an asshole. I know. But I like it. How's that escape of yours going? Making progress. Wait, his voice I'm sounds just like Mike's. Away in a truck. And Mike's! Communications are hot. You really pissed him off, Fox. I guess we're both gifted with pissing people off. Sorry about the concrete joke, by the way. <laughs> nah, don't worry about it. Better to have a sense of humor about being jailed over some concrete blocks. By the way, you haven't seen them, right? I've seen concrete everywhere, Robert. But nothing as big as you mentioned. Ah, well. Send a postcard when you get home, my friend. Definitely. Over and out. Uh, it's crazy Zeke has like a thousand plus viewers. I remember back when old Zeke had like 50. Ah, I never had just 50. I started off pretty good, man. I was... I was, you know, sucking the farts out of Man vs. Game's ass, so I, I think I started with a head start, probably about 100, 150 at least. You know, so, like, it wasn't fair. Like, I didn't start with zero, but neither did Stephen Colbert when he left The Daily Show, you know what I'm saying? The truck stopped at last. Its destination was a small port owned by the clandestine base. Looked like the truck was carrying packages to be transported by sea. Mm. As we arrived, I overheard a conversation between the driver and a hangar officer. Uh, you were like Colbert? Colbert? Yeah. I, and, and man is like uh, uh, John Stewart. Like, John Stewart will always be revered as, like, the first and best comedy news caster show, whatever. But Steve's done all right on his own. I think it's pretty, pretty similar. <laughs> Are you gonna tell me what the fuck you're bringing me at this time of night? Sir, I have an order to send this load by sea. Fuck! You're waking me up for this? I already told your officer. All maritime operations are canceled. We're waiting for the nuclear warheads to arrive. And we what? won't ship anything else. Nuclear? There's a new order. Oh, shit. Hold on. You said nuclear warheads? Yeah. Yes, that's what I heard them say. God save us. That's impossible. You sound just like the Colonel. Report Colonel Harris. Report to Colonel Harris. Another typo, Jack. Report to Colonel Harris. Or not typo, syntax. Challenge unlocked. Just some boxes. Destroy five crates with the explosion of a single grenade. Oh, okay. Or is it? You know what? I didn't have a chance to really read it all that well, so maybe it wasn't. Maybe it's fine. Um. Did it? Did it say like I blew my way out of here or something? I might have missed that part if it said like, I blasted my way out of here. Oh, report to Colonel Harris. Oh, that's my new mission. That's right. I'm not talking to Colonel Harris in the, in the interview scene. That's right. So I got to talk to him first, right? Okay, that makes sense. Colonel Harris, are you there? Here I am, son. You sound tense. Are you all right? Where are you? I escaped in a truck. I'm now in a hangar at a port. That's great news. Find a phone and call. Not so fast, Colonel. It's an ex-army port. I'm not safe yet. I have new information about Operation Jericho. Just overheard a conversation. Sounds like they're waiting for... nuclear warheads. Dun-dun-dun! Warheads! That's impossible. 
Are you certain? That's what I heard. This can't be. You just can't pluck nuclear weapons out of thin air. They're extensively regulated. Is it possible they stole them? Yeah, we don't have any news about any theft in any country. If they were stolen, either a country hid the fact or it happened while I was captive here. Is it possible to build them? These people have a lot of resources. They need radioactive material and it can't be freely obtained. Not to mention a big lab and highly skilled people to produce them. Whatever the case, they managed to acquire some. If that's true, son, we're screwed. Hold on, Colonel. I heard something. Crap, they started the engine. I'll call you later. I have to jump out before the truck drives off. Nice jump. Close the door. All right. Get out of the hangar. Nothing in there. Oh, oh, oh. It's just five, right? Nailed it. And <laughs> that guard didn't see shit, huh? Or or no one heard anything? That's awesome. Oh fuck, there's the nuke. Uh, Zeke, thanks for the GeForce Now stream today. You may have gotten paid for it, but thanks to you, I'm playing games I brought, I bought up to eight years ago that my laptop could never play. Oh, dude, that's great. Like I said, man, I don't mind shilling for something that's a fucking good product, and I think GeForce Now is a fucking good product. Hey, Leonard, look, it's the prisoner. What? Leonard, not Mike. Oh, these guys were Leonard's. Mike doesn't fit engineers. Quick, call for backup. So they get the credit? No way! I'm fed up with them making fun of us <laughs> just because we're engineers. You're right, Leonard. They treat us like nobodies because we don't carry a rifle. Our weapon is our intellect. To the controls! <laughs> we'll tell them we saw the prisoner. <laughs> <laughs> Night. <laughs> Activating radial saw. Guys, you're engineers. Don't play soldiers with me, okay? I won't hurt you. Come on, let me pass. I'll give you some trading cards. Eat a dick. Fine. I don't know what you have on those computers, but any unsaved work is going to get lost. The saws were controlled by the terminals. I only had to destroy <laughs> them, and with all the noise in the hangar, a few explosions wouldn't draw any attention. But I had to be careful not to kill the engineers. And heal them, in case they got injured. Okay. Oh. Engineering problems. I, I was hoping, I was really hoping that would happen. And I am glad that it did.
Okay. I had to see. What I did that? Oh, did I just do it to myself? Ah, jeez. Damn, I started to give hints. No! Get out of here! So hold on. I got. So if I run out of grenades, wonder what, I mean. Hmm. Wonder what I do. I mean, I'm, I'm guessing I just, no. Okay. <laughs> I'm just curious, like, if I if I used all those grenades before I got to that save point, would I be fucked? That is real catchy. Mm. Thus is the problem when you have everything doing everything on the same button. Okay. Uh, Jethro22 with the prime sub. Thank you, Jethro. Hey, Overseeker! <laughs> Brand new warrior! Uh, by the way, no, a note to make the healing of others be more sticky is on the patch notes. Oh, that'd be great, yeah. Or like, you know what would be even better? Like a prompt to heal others would be like, you know how like when you're standing against the wall and it says X to punch? Like, if, if you get close to them, it says, like, whatever, why to heal. It gives you a clue, like, oh, okay, there we go. That'd be cool. I don't know if it's easy to, to like, transfer one thing to other, but... I'm an ideas man! Not I'm not the person that puts it into practice. X to glide. X to glide! Oh, can I not, can I potty with these guys around? Oh, you bet I can.
Uh, that might be a good idea. I just, just, if, if you aren't bleeding, it will do a run to the body if nearby. Kind of like the chloroform home in. Yeah, sure. <laughs> fucking did it right ag <sighs> uh, again. Again, I did it like that. Mother shit. What? Blood. Do you copy? I do. Copy, Colonel. Still in that hangar? Yes, Colonel. Still trying to figure out how to get out of here. By the way, guess what? They have a mini rescue submarine. Rescue? <laughs> and it's yellow! These look like they go around rescuing people. We I'm all getting inside to have a look. Yellow submarine. Maybe I can ride it out of here. Tell me there's gonna be a Sergeant Pepper around here. Come on. Let me overhear a Sergeant Pepper. Sergeant Pepper. Well, look at what we have here. Ah, fiddling with the control files fires and compartments. I managed to discover the submarine's logbook. It contained details about its last mission, a rescue operation. The details didn't catch my attention at first. But this log what up, turned out to hold exactly the answers we were looking for. The fourth document was the logbook of a mini rescue submarine. It mentioned its last mission, a successful rescue operation from a week ago. The target was a sinking submarine. The K-278... Hold on. Does that map say, like, Barent? B-A-R-E-N-T-S? It consomolets. Suffering from an onboard fire in the Barents Sea. Oh. Apparently, two nuclear torpedoes were salvaged during the job. The warheads involved in Operation Jericho. The third file of Operation Jericho was quite revealing. It had a map of the Cantor province with exact coordinates. An ambush plan and a picture of the colonel with his name under it. Oh. We're repeating now. We're back to the beginning. Okay. Did you find anything, Fox? I found a logbook with a single recorded mission. It says, Mission, Deep Rescue, Successfully Completed. Return date. Fuck, a week ago. I'll continue reading. <laughs> Rescue in the Barents Sea. Objective, Submarine K-278 Komsomolets. Damn it. The Komsomolets. Have you heard of it? Of course. It's a Soviet submarine that sank after catching fire. But I can't think of anything. That's gotta be a reference or something, them right? And the Soviets. Maybe they're a Russian faction and went to rescue their comrades. Or they could be trying to trade the crewmen for Russian nukes or something. Fox, this wasn't a rescue mission. But the log says The Komsomolets sank over a year oh, ago. Oh, it's a real thing, okay. There's not a soul alive down there. It's not people they were hauling. It was something else. Nukes. Colonel, what was the sub armed with? As far as I know, two nuclear torpedoes. Fuck. Fuck. There it is. The oh. nuclear warheads for Operation Jericho. Well, thanks, Jack. Kindly donated by the Soviet Union in a game of Finders Keepers. If what you say is true, they had to bring those torpedoes in by sea and take them to a lab. The whole Comsolots have been contaminated by the radiation. Which means they would need a sarcophagus. A sarcophagus? Like the one for Tutankhamun? Did you smoke something, Colonel? <laughs> Don't be an idiot, Fox. A sarcophagus is something that confines radiation, preventing everyone from dying while they transport the goods. It has to be something thick, heavy. Like my skull. Like two huge concrete, concrete blocks. blocks. Oh, okay. Fuck. I have to call Robert. 
Fox. Robert! What's up, Colonel? I hear footsteps. Soldiers are walking down the hall. Damn it. I think my time is up. Listen to me carefully, son. The situation is critical. You have to escape as soon as possible and call the Cavalier. Understood? The fate of countless people rests on you. Call the Cavalier? Colonel Harris out. Not the Cavalier! Like in communication with Colonel Harris. <laughs> <laughs> Quit being so cavalier with those nukes. What? Hey, Fox, oh. are you there? Shit, I forgot Here to call I am, him. Robert. Yeah, we gotta call Robert. Fox, looks like you're gonna transfer a prisoner. Someone called Alan Harris. I know. Do you know what they plan to do? No idea, Fox. But looks like the orders are coming from top brass. You're really pissing them off, my friend. Be careful. Maybe they'll use him against you. I'll keep that in mind. By the way, there it is. I have something to tell you about your concrete. Don't tell me them. Man, you rock. I don't know where they are, but they've been used as a sarcophagus. A sarcophagus? Like the one for Tutankhamun? Did you smoke something, Fox? Oh, recall of humor. Not. I mean a thick container to oh, contain shit. radiation. Dude. Radiation? I can't believe Please you guys tell let me they're not nukes. Without... They are from a sunken Soviet submarine. Shit. That's why there's so much secrecy and surveillance. Cheer up, Robert. Your capture isn't for something trivial anymore. It's for a nuclear arms race. Fuck, fuck, fuck. This news is the bomb. That's a literal way to say it. Oh my god. Keep me informed, my friend. I want to know why. I heard beach. that. I will, Robert. And that's Over and out. just. Ugh. Ugh. Man, that was a pun too far. Uh, what vape do I have? I have a Vaporesso Taro baby. I don't think you can get it anymore, though. But Vaporesso, it's, it's good stuff. It's. I mean, it's stuck with me for. I don't know how long I've had it, but I've had it for a few years. Works just fine. Well. I mean. Uh, will you play Far Cry 6? I'm sure at some point. I probably won't play the story, though. Probably be just, uh... Me and another dude fucking around. Montana boys will be back at it. We'll have to. <laughs> I finally located a recycling bin. <laughs> I've been needing one for a while. Why the hell did you need a recycling bin? Yeah. To get rid of some stuff. Oh, really? But couldn't you just toss them on the ground? Oh, we're going to clean up my inventory. Me for some sort of shit bag? Hey. You were behind enemy lines. Nice. It wouldn't be unreasonable. Look, Lieutenant, I don't abandon my principles at the first sign of adversity. I see. Now, why did you get rid of items that may be handy later? Exactly. Because the more stuff you have, the more you're a slave to your own possessions. Oh, God. And nothing enslaves me. <laughs> so, I threw away that, everything that I didn't that need. fucking pause. An act that's common to minimalists such as yourself. Minimalist? Me? Where'd you get that stupid idea? Take a look at yourself. You look angry and disappointed. As if you're having minimalist intercourse. How dare you! Relax, Sergeant. It's obvious what Mr. Fox is trying to do. We've been here for a long time. We're tired, even slightly agitated. Mr. Fox is trying to take advantage of that by getting on my nerves with petty insults. 
hoping I attack him and provide an officer misconduct charge that enables him to be set free. But that is not going to work, Mr. Fox. Look, I'm used to interrogating assholes like you. Fuck. You got me, officer. I underestimated you. Fuck. I have to admit that you're very good. Uh, well, thanks. I'm, uh, <clears throat> yeah, well, uh, let's <laughs> continue. You said that you got rid of some items. What was that salted water for? I never used it on anything. Damn it. That sucks. Yeah, it was some I'm guessing it was some sort of Easter egg that I never got to. Out of the hangar, okay. With the, in the submarine, I'm guessing, but I, I just check it. I did not remember to salt these nuts. I did that on purpose, by the way. Just so I can get back down to the bottom of that, you know, hassle. Oh, did it say what key it's? Is it the key to the submarine? The submarine key? Do they need keys? I would think the submarines wouldn't need keys, but you know, whatever. After putting the key in the lock and turning it, the sub started to move. M -m 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 Mother I took of the mini Jedi, submarine 34 months. channels beneath the hangar. Seriously? Now you can drive mini submarines? Nope. Never done it before in my life. But I found a manual. Oh, nice. Can you read Russian? Yep. Of course not. Damn it. It was in English. The mini submarine was American. All oh, right, yeah. It was a pretty smooth ride. I didn't have to worry about the battery levels, oxygen, or depth. Yay! And the inside was very comfortable. <laughs> I could practically live in there. Beautiful. No oh, mini well, management? Of course. It's an American product. <laughs> what did you expect? Yeah. Yeah. But you know how American vehicles are. Uh. They practically explode on contact. Ever seen an action movie? Anyways, that's why I oh, avoided God. any collisions. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, I knew it! Ninja Turtles, isn't it? Oh, God, it's like a Ninja Turtles fucking level! Shit! Okay. Okay. Three. I get three. Three hits.
Oh shit, I found a I found a potty. Isn't that nice? And that just just for breaking the door. Hmm. Yeah, damage done based on momentum, right? Yeah, I noticed that. It was a smaller uh, HP loss. Why would you put the potty there? Why? Seems so out of the way when the save is just one screen over. Not even one screen, it's the starting screen. May oh, probably to empty out the ones he already had. Okay, but I mean, I mean, yeah, duh. Okay, so there was there is something that I'm missing here. Uh Kerblet, thank you for 59 months. No, I tried. I, maybe I'm not I didn't do the right thing. I wasn't pressing the triggers. You have to get him from this side. You saw me go all the way around to the back, right? Also, uh, don't... Play the fucking game yourself. Let me fail, please, it's okay. Wasn't it funnier that I exploded? Wasn't it funnier that I'm now bitching about the fact that I couldn't get him from this side? <laughs> Shit. Nope. I was wondering if I got a re uh, like a free repair on my sub and the answer is no. You do not. You do not get a free repair from docking your sub. There was a passage opened up. There's a fucking wall behind the shadows. Suck my ass. God damn it. 
What up, Kerblin? Thank you for the 59 months. See, okay. You don't get torpedoes. So I was like, okay, those are just those are just set decoration. Do you have any plans to play Lost Judgment on your stream? No. I don't have any plans to play anything on my stream. I just kind of like... Just like... Type a random set of letters into Steam and do the search function and that's what I play. I'm sure at some point I'll do it. I'm just not sure when. Probably like way down the road. Once everybody's forgotten about it, that it was that it came out, like, oh shit, that's right, Lost Judgment came out. That's when I'll play it. No, oh, fuck you. How'd I heal my sub? I exploded and started over. <laughs> Shit, I hit the ceiling. God, please. I was like, nah, that's not enough momentum. I won't hit. No worries. I feel lonely, locked in that submarine underwater. <laughs> nah, I had some company. Huge eel! <laughs> or a huge L? Unagi Blast, what is this? Defeat huge eel, or hug eel, firing just six torpedoes. Did I win? Well, that's not how you do it? Okay. <laughs> you had to feel lonely. Hug eel these nuts! Oh, 
shit. I didn't even see the mash! You can mash to like, I don't know, make it let you go or something? You had to film. Are these just a refill of... Yeah. What am I... What am I mashing even? Because it didn't do that before, but I had I had too much health gone from that first part. Damn it! You had to feel alone. I had too much health gone from the mashing part. To feel alone. Yep, I had the rhythm. Oh, fuck! Bam. Shit! I know, yeah, I had to what? I had to do something. Can't get chomped again. <clears throat> you had all right. Come on, no chompies. There, okay.
Can I do it? Boss defeated. I did. Okay, Nagi Blast. I got it. Okay, we got it. We good. Um. Okay, let's go to the top one. Do I get to keep the thing? Okay, I do. Hi! How's it going? <laughs> What was that? Oh, that's an Easter egg. It looks like a glitch. If you wait enough, I mean, there he goes. Yeah, no, it's, yeah, exactly. Wait, wait, wait. Let's make sure. No secrets to be had. Okay. How about on this side? No. Okay. It's an Easter egg! <laughs> I get it, that's a great one! Holy bartender! God damn it! I missed another secret! Boom docks. I ended up in what looked like a dock. There were containers and stuff. The sea was slightly rough. Oh, and there was a storm. I feel no shame. I'm proud of where I came from. I was born and raised in the boom docks. Um, I know no matter where I go, I keep my heart and soul in the boondocks. It's where I learned about living. It's where I learned about love. It's where I learned about working hard. Having to live was just enough. It's where I learned about Jesus. Knowing where I stand. You can take it or leave it, but this is me. This is who I am. <laughs> I actually like that song. It's a good song. All right, break time. Gonna take our last break of the day, y'alls.